I'm getting irritated. Because I can't do this. Let's just hope. Let's hope this goes right, guys. You're my fire, holding tighter. What's mine is hers, uh, vice versa. Okay. Okay, so I started off doing my hair. This is just literally to hold down everything. Guys, I'm not a hair, I'm not good with hair. Like, I'm not a hair guru. I can do my makeup to a decent amount, but hair guru. Guru, that's not me. I need my friend Osarian to come and help me. So she's gonna help me with that. But my friend Vanessa helped me make this wig. She's talented. She was telling me how um, the hair is really soft. Um, and I can feel right now that the hair is really soft. It's like I got the um, the Malaysian curly hair in 22, 22, 24 with a 20 inch closure. So yeah, I will show you. I got a free part closure, so I I kind of wanted to make it look like a um a front wall to get the gist. But um yeah, this hair doesn't it doesn't shed like it doesn't really shed like it's kind of like it's good. Um, I think it's really nice. Like it's so soft. Like usually when I, like with curly hair, like when I have curly hair in, yeah, it's just like annoying and it's matted but this hair is soft like I could like a finger comb it look just look just like look it, my hands just going through with no tingling no tingling <laughs> no tangling like do you get what I'm saying yeah I'm gonna wet it later on like when I'm styling it you guys will see that but first let's start off with the makeup guys I've had a um interesting setup day um I don't know if I'm gonna talk this through or if I'm gonna make it. I might just make it chit chat already with me to be fair. But um it's just annoying. Actually annoying, but um I finally finished uni. Yeah, I'm making it a chit chat get ready with me. I've decided. I may I'm making it a chit chat get ready. But um I finally finished uni. If I'm looking down it's because my mirror's down. Um thank God. Well, I say finish uni. Okay, I'm just making, this is what I'm saying. Every, like, I'm all over the place. I was meant to prime my face, but I started doing my eyebrow. Do you see, do you see that? What, what? Guys, I'm in a different, I'm in a different world right now. Okay, so I'm priming my face. Let's see, just prime my face. With the benefit professional. And that pond me pores. I have like really bad pores or yeah. Like also it's hazy for taking anybody like usually at uni I don't have hay fever but because I live like I wouldn't say the countryside but I live like in a village in a town like there's a lot more grass than there is in uni so i'm taking black opal powder in medium to set my primer but yeah there's a lot more grass than there is in uni so i'm finding that like i'm getting hay fever like a stuffy nose my eyes are itching but i use benadryl from benadryl oh i look like i put baby powder on my face but like I'm using like Benadryl and it pretty much get, it pretty much gets the job done to be honest if I'm being honest but um yeah I was I was saying that um I finally done with uni Goodness, I can't lie to you. Ex well, I didn't have exams. I was gonna say exam season. I didn't have exams. I had coursework, but deadline season. Oh my gosh, it was just stressful. Like actually stressful. Like, like I just had so much coursework, and I saw this tweet the other day. Like, you need like the stress that you get in uni is usually because of poor time management. And that tweet was probably like, 
99% accurate. Like, maybe you get stressed. If I manage my time properly, I, would, I wouldn't really be stressed, you know what I'm saying? But, because I... Guys, I'm just gonna leave the mirror in there because I need it down. Sorry, but, um, yeah. I'm going through this stage right now where I'm like, I'm so, like, trying to get my money up. Not like just trying to be rich or like just trying to be like money orientated. Not like that. Just like I want to have a name for myself. The sun just come out. I don't know if the lighting is not weird, but yeah, the sun just come out. But um, like I, I kind of just want to have like a name for myself. Like I want to build myself. I don't want to be dependent on anyone. Like that's what I want to say to all like all the girls. Like make sure. You are actually like focusing on yourself. Like I say this all the time to my subscribers, especially to the girls. I mean it to the guys as well, but I know no guys are really gonna watch this. That's what I'm saying to the girls. Um get your money up, sis. Like focus on what you enjoy doing. Whether that be YouTube, hair, I'm used to that hair, but YouTube hair, makeup, fashion, like my sis Brie, she does, um, like she hand makes her own like clothes, she's just so good, like everyone follow her, I'm going to put her Instagram like there or there or there or there, <laughs> and in the description, but like, her work is just so good and like her work ethic is just amazing like so everyone just get your money up bro like all my sisters are just like getting their money up and working on themselves when i tell you that's the it's the most rewarding thing like when you feel like you've accomplished something and i feel like many girls in this generation feel like like being in a relationship is an accomplishment when it really isn't like it's not anything it's not i'm not saying it's not anything sorry i'm not saying it's not anything to be proud of i'm using them ah oh, i use anastasia beverly was my eyebrows yeah um i was saying many girls okay i did anastasia beverly hills the brow pomade in ebony on my eyebrows but like as i was saying and i'm using the makeup revolution concealer to clean up in c13 i was saying Many girls feel like a relationship is an accomplishment. And like, to an extent, like, it's, it's cute and everything. Like, everybody wants love. For well, most people want love, but that's not your biggest accomplishment. You want to make accomplishments by yourself first before like anyone comes and accomplishes you do you get what i'm saying like you want to have accomplished something on your own rather than like doing it with someone else like do you get what i'm saying so something that you can call your own like it's important Foundation. 
as I was saying, finally finished uni for the summer. And as like you guys that watch my channel or like some of you guys are new actually, so you don't know, but um I changed courses, so this was my um um doing my course broadcast journalism and I enjoyed this year much better than I did last year with media communication. I just always recommend everyone doing their research on what they want to study because listen changing a course is not fun it's not fun at all but you just feel like you're behind but like all the time like all the time like you always need to remember that like you're in your own race and you shouldn't compare yourself to anyone because that will be your biggest downfall but um yeah like literally um i'm using a modern renaissance palette I'm literally gonna do like the quickest eye makeup look ever. Um, um, I've been having fun with eyeshadow looks. Did I say eye makeup look? Eyeshadow. You know, sometimes yeah, when you say something, you don't know whether you said it or what you said or how you said it. Yeah, that's me right now. I'm like struggling with what I said. But what are you guys' plans for this summer? I really want to vlog a lot more. Um, this summer like I want to make sure that I vlog for you lot like I feel like you guys know me but because obviously I post a lot of videos and stuff but like you guys don't see like if you have me on snap add me on snap I'm gonna put it on the screen if you have me on snap you see how goofy I am and how silly like me and my friends are but like if you're like vlogging what I'm doing like it will be more fun to show you lot in it like I feel like that's like letting you in to my guys my guys into my letting you guys in, into my life um i hope this this light is all okay because i can't see but yeah letting you guys into my life like it'll be funny and cute and like like let me know in the comment section do you guys want to see vlogs Vlogs. Like even though sometimes I don't do anything, like I'm gonna tell you guys that now. Sometimes I'm not doing anything. So do you guys just want to see me like at home with my family? Although my brothers probably would be up to that, but like I'll still put it in. So do you guys want to see vlogs of what I get up to? Let me know. Mm. Unless the eyeshadow look. When I say it's gonna be quick, it's gonna be quick. I'm gonna speed through and do my highlight and contouring because you guys have seen this before. Season two and how um, the bullying's gotten to an extreme this 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 season. I feel like wow, like especially the last episode. I don't want to give it away and like say what was done, but um, why am I looking for these? So you put everything on my table. Uh, it's so annoying when you're looking for stuff. The hell? Oh, it's right in front of me. So silly. Um, but yeah, 
the bullying is just a bit much it's too much like i cried i couldn't believe that like, i cried like it was just so sad like like i get the hold on I'm just come to the moment i get the concept here of like making awareness but oh my goodness like yo the bullying just made me cry i was like like the fact that people some people go through this and they can't like speak about it is just too much for me like i cry at almost everything but that was just it was too much for one person to handle i feel like i've contoured my guys today is just going wrong i feel like i've contoured my nose wrong but um yeah 13 reasons they don't disappoint i can that's one thing i can say like they definitely don't disappoint like that season was really spectacular they know how to like have really good cliffhangers and make people drawn in i understand why some people don't agree with it for 13 reasons because it is very explicit but they say that back in the beginning of it they say it is very explicit um i put a tweet out about it i didn't i kind of didn't want to put it out because i didn't want to seem like insensitive but i feel like it's, it kind of did say it in the show as well but i kind of feel like hannah baker was a bit of an attention seeker as well it was kind of getting on my nerves like i was just like there's some things like it's just irritating but a, like a lesson that i learned as well like people take things differently and people go through things differently people handle things differently so yeah but um one thing as well that i learned in the show was that like um for the amount of reasons you have to like want to kill yourself or commit suicide there's always more reasons why you shouldn't and it was just beautiful like the ending like it was just beautiful was, well not the ending because i mean the ending of discussing hannah baker i would say like it was beautiful guys i'm using the same products i always use the sleek contour kit makeup revolution concealer um yeah this is the finished look basically this i done this um like the rest of our camera i haven't added any water to the hair this is the hair 
and I really like it. It's very soft. Like I said, I'm not a hairstylist, so I'm not really. I'm, I'm just gonna go about go out with it like this. But um, yeah, it's Ali Beauty Forever Hair. Um, this is in the inches 22, 22, 24, and a 20 inch closure. Um, yeah, Malaysian curly. And guys, it's so soft, like I'm really happy with it. Like I don't really get like really nice curly hair, but I'm really happy with it. It comes in a nice box, the box is upstairs. I might like, um, I put it on my snap. So if you have me on snap, I showed you on snap. And on Instagram, you're gonna see it. But um, yeah, thanks for watching guys. Make sure you check all their details down below. Ali Beauty Forever Hair. And make sure you guys like, comment and subscribe. Bye. Pretty girl at a mercy. She said she with a friend curse Hypnotize me and she curse